Good evening, everyone. I hope everyone's having a fantastic evening. <clears throat> Welcome back to Do Mod Monday. <sighs> and I, I don't know why I torture myself so with this with this mod. Hey, loser, hope you're having a great day as well. You play, you always say that you are, so I hope you're telling me the truth. I really do. But, um, it's always great having you here, man. You said 247, but you gave up. <laughs> this could be a lot worse, but you gave up. I could be at like 300 now, you wouldn't know, because you gave up. You're a quitter. <sighs> well, as you know, doing my money in the past, I think six weeks has been dedicated to the Sunlust mod. And at the urging of a viewer, I started doing pistol starts because that's apparently how the game was meant to be played. Not continuous, as I had played the first couple of levels doing. So, ever since I think mission three or four, I've been doing it pistol starts, and I have hated myself every step of the way. And yet, despite that, I feel less frustrated with some of the encounters I've done in the Doom, Doom Eternal DLC. This somehow feels less frustrating. I don't know, probably because I can save whenever I want. Maybe I should not die so many times. L listen. Listen. Okay, you think I'm trying to do this? Huh? Huh? I don't want to die so many times, but I've never played this WAD before. Okay? 
I'm doing pistol starts, so I don't have weaponry at the beginning. It's only a matter of time before I die under those circumstances, right? Well, nothing less for it. Nothing left for it, I guess, so. Let's go back in. I'm on map 15. I got 319 enemies. Fantastic. Giving me some armor right off the bat here. Good. Nice moon skybox and a backpack full of ammo. So, I feel like I'm going to need a lot of ammo for this map then. Oh, wait. Well, let's save before going down here. Geronimo! Typically in a Doom lot, I'd be happy to see weaponry, but uh, if you're giving me weaponry, that usually means I'm about to die. Alright, well, let's see what the first... <laughs> I'm saving every, like, ten steps now. Uh, I'm pretty sure I just heard a cyber demon. These guys are getting really hard on for the cyber demon. I wouldn't know you you would come from that direction. I have a berserk, okay? I am insanely overpowered right now. Look at the force. Look at the damage. Okay, this this however was not a good idea. <laughs> Trying to save. I thought I saved after I killed that for some reason. Yeah, if I can't get right up to them without being in a specific spot, maybe I shouldn't be trying to berserk punch them. I, you know, just a thought. Same as level again? Strength and anger. Uh, I don't know about strength, but I've experienced a lot of anger <laughs> playing this wad. And yet again, less anger than the Doom Eternal DLC. Oh, what the F is this now? Uh, I mean, this looks cool. Looks like they put a lot of effort into it, but, um. Oh, I was sure that was going to open up all sorts of nonsense out there. But then I'm guessing it's going to open up a whole bunch of nonsense in here instead. I am confused. What did that do? Was this something before? Oh great, I'm down here now. Oh my god! That is too much- oh Jesus. I was about to say, the, it just- it can't just be Hell Knights. Oh Jesus Christ! What just happened? That... You platinum Resident Evil Zero, it was fine. Didn't you already know that though? Like I thought the whole shtick with Resident Evil Zero was that at best it was mediocre. Like, I haven't heard great things about the early Resident Evil games. Okay. First one's dead. You wanted to play it because Resident Evil 2 Remake is supposed to be great? I think I have painted myself into a very bad corner here.
Hard difficulty was extremely hard. So, extremely appropriate then. Now, how the fuck am I supposed to do this? Oh, artif oh, that kind of hurt. Okay. I really don't know how I'm supposed to go about this. Oh, I walked right into that. Uh, I needed him to die. I might have, but then again, I'm barely in the level, so I also don't know how bad I've truly made things. Okay, well, I do shit like that, it's gonna be pretty bad. I'm not sitting on a ton of health, but I killed one of them, so I'm gonna go with mission accomplished. I don't hit myself in the face. I willingly let other things hit me in the face. Okay, I've got things whittled down nice here. I just always said to myself, you know, the best way to pass the time is to have somebody hit you in the face with shit. I mean, do you people not feel the same way? that having someone hit you in the face is the appropriate way to go about things. <laughs> You're just gonna hold that over my head now. We already like, oh, I've platinum Resident Evil Zero. What have you done? Huh? What have you accomplished in your life? See, I, there's something off to the side of the map here. So I'm kind of wondering if there's something here. No, Dark Souls Platinum might be your, like, favorite Platinum. But that's not necessarily the one you would brag about the most, right? You might brag about the Resident Evil Zero one because you're like, it's stupid. But you know what? I did it. Because the, the impression I get is that Dark Souls... You know, oh, for fuck's sake. Oh, Jesus H. Christ. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. There's no, there's no escape. There's no escape. Goodbye, cruel world. Goodbye. Goodbye. <laughs> Nothing like a little bit of panic to really <laughs> get things going here. Where am I? I know I almost got out. I thought for a second maybe I'll do it, but... Alas, no. Okay, so there's a BFG here. I know it. Ugh. I got myself killed by hitting myself in the face with a rocket. Oh no, I, I thought about that after I'd done it. it it's kind of like if you ever said something stupid as it was coming out of your mouth, you go, oh Jesus Christ. That's exactly what I just experienced.
Never doesn't sound like you? Nah, never. You've never done it. All that's come out of your mouth has been intelligent rhetoric. Oh, hello. What are you doing up here? Okay. I don't know how I'm going to deal with you, but I'm going to deal with you somehow. That was like a guaranteed kill, two of those point blank. Ah, damn it. <laughs> Remember when Cyber Demons were scary bosses? I mean, a Cyber Demon can still be scary, depending on how they're used. Like, that situation wasn't that scary, but. It can still happen, but yes, I mean. The the funny thing about this about I think most bosses with or all the bosses I mean with uh, the Doom franchise was they weren't really they weren't really good bosses when you think about it because I mean like when you play the first the first episode what was the boss of the first episode two barons of hell now granted you didn't have a plasma rifle or a BFG when you fought them. But, you had a rocket launcher, right? And I mean, considering the only things you fought in the entire first episode were zombie men, imps, and pinkies, you definitely had enough, um, where the hell is that going? You definitely had more than enough rockets left behind unless you were absolutely, like, terrible aim or something. So, the first boss, two barons, you clean them out in like seconds. There's nothing to defeating them. I missed that up. Absolutely nothing to defeating them. Right? God damn it. So then, on to the second boss, which is a cyber demon. You know, again, don't have the BFG, which is good for the difficulty. Damn it. Fuck me. <laughs> so you don't have the BFG, but you have a plasma rifle. And yes, the plasma rifle still takes a little while to kill a cyber demon. But they give you this big, wide open place where you can fight them. Right? There's no real danger to them. And then, of course, the Spider Mastermind was the worst offender because. Spider Mastermind was the worst offender because. Oh, that actually hurts me. Um. Because you had the BFG in episode 3. And the Spider Mastermind, because its model is so wide, can be insta killed by. If you get right up in her face and fire the BFG once, she dies. Right? So. There's. No scariness to that boss whatsoever. What am I supposed to do here? Okay, yeah, I'm down here. Is there... Oh, over here. I don't know how I'm not dead yet. Ah, there it is. <laughs> I was like, come on. Something's got to surround me here in a second. Rockets probably won't work here. No, it won't. It doesn't work. Yeah, but they, no uh, guarantee you keep the plasma ammo, but they dump plasma ammo on you on the beginning of the level. Are you sure? I'm pretty sure there was plasma rifle ammo.
I'm pretty sure they do. Now you got me down myself. Although there was rockets, there was both, as far as I knew. <laughs> yeah, go look it up. It'll take you like two seconds. That didn't work quite the way I was hoping it would. So, I don't know if the intent was for me to use my BFG ammo there, but I don't know how else I would have done that. Okay, so now I'm supposed to go up here. Okay. Maybe I should stop rushing it. Like, you know, whoa, what the frig? What the hell happened there? I just loaded and my guy was like, Wee! Try this again. Do, 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 do. Why are there so many of you? My god, every level, there's like 50 of them. Oh boy, what fresh help. Okay, not dealing with that kind of crap. It is just rockets, or? But even then, rockets wouldn't be that big of a deal to fight him with. But yes, you're right, he is the best boss. Absolutely. Now that being said, you and I have always, you know, done a continuous run of the Doom franchise. Maybe it would be interesting, like I was doing a little while back a pistol start run of Doom, which is something I had never done before. Oh, okay. Cyberdemon again. So it'd be, it might be interesting for me to continue that, maybe, you know, uh, later on, uh, when I finish Doom Eternal and I'm looking for other things to play, I'll play a bit of, um, I'll play, I'll continue my, uh, Doom Pistol Start, because a Doom Pistol Start run would be interesting to do, because I've never done one, and it would be interesting to see how it affects the, uh, Shit. It would be interesting to see how it affects the actual uh, gameplay and like how challenging are the levels really. And yeah, you're right, there's no splash damage there on the uh, Cyber Demon fight, but I still don't... Like, it'd be tedious, but I don't think it'd be difficult. They give you plenty of places to, uh... Oh, I'm sure it'd be much more difficult, too, but how difficult would it be? Would it be absolutely grueling? Um... Because I don't think, like, Episode 1 or 2 or even 3 would be that bad with just a pistol start. I mean, four would definitely suck trying to pistol start everything with in, in that game. 
You mean like the chat window's too small? How about this? This look better? Uh, let me. Uh, let me just see something here. Let me crank this up a little bit. There we go. Uh, if I finish Sunless, what's my next Doom mod? I'm actually not positive. I'm thinking there was like uh, one I saw, like Evil Entity or Evel, something like that. I'm thinking I'll do that next. I've heard great things about that mod. Okay. The spots where that guy is able to hit me is very inconsistent. Not gonna be TNT? Why would I play TNT? You constantly talk about how crappy TNT is. So why would I willingly play a crappy mod? <laughs> Don't stop coming. God damn it! <laughs> okay, I think I had the proper strap by getting rid of him first, though. Just pump rockets. Just continuously pump rockets. Stop letting demons get really close to you. Stop being hit by Hell Knight fireballs. Or in that particular case, walking right into the fucking thing. Okay. I appear to be fine. Oh, Jesus, that's already even died! <laughs> Killed him. I didn't even get to see what was going on in there. Uh, so can you complete the original Doom trilogy, quadrilogy? Do the master levels count? I don't know. I think most people think the master levels do not count. Or at least that's the meme that they don't count. So when you say the Doom Trilogy, you mean like Ultimate Doom, Doom 2, and Final Doom? Oh, Jesus Christ. And, and Final Doom? Is that what you mean by the... Yeah, but the way you talk about it, that's like be <laughs> being better than TNT is like beating a five-year-old at arm wrestling. <laughs> I mean, I thought it was great to walk away with a win, but... <laughs> In the end, I don't think you can walk away feeling super proud of yourself. Or would you just die? God damn it. Well, maybe that's like my next project. Uh, you know, like, I'll still be doing Doom Mod Monday and. Eve. Eve Eternity? Eve Eternity? Okay. That's what the one I was talking about. Thank you, Loser Corner. I'll probably try that one for Doom on Monday. Um, but what I'd probably do then, like, I think later on when I finish Doom Eternal, I might do a few more, like, Doom streams. And what I'll do during my Doom streams is I'll do something like, um, try to do some more pistol starts of, like, Doom and Doom 2, something I haven't done before. 
you know, I was thinking that, or if, you know, since I seem to be on this self-hating kick that, I mean, I'm playing Sunlust, <laughs> what more proof do you need? I kind of hate myself. I was thinking maybe I'll even try learning how to do Nightmare Runs. How is this not secret? It's fine for difficulty, just boring. You're talking about TNT or the master levels? Hmm. So I still haven't found a single frickin' secret. I'll tell you that much. Okay, yeah, exit through there. What a lame secret. <laughs> Jesus. I love, I love when they just put switches in, in rooms in this wad. It, it, it always works out very well for me. Well then! Oh Jesus, they're actually everywhere. Oh God, there's a cyber demon. Like... Wadmakers, what is your damage? Who hurt you? Why do you have these... These latent issues that you need to... You feel the need to work out by... Causing us so much pain. There's nowhere to go! <laughs> I can't go down there, there's a cyber demon! There's, there's nowhere safe! I'm just doing circle runs, I don't know where the missiles are! I'm do everything is on, just on faith! I'm doing all this on faith! Did you do the No Rest for the Living Doom 2 expansion on the BFG edition? I actually don't remember if I did. Okay, trying to bottleneck them was clearly a bad idea. Nope, that was also not a good idea. I actually don't remember, but I almost... I'm, I'm not sure, but it kind of depends. Was there an achievement attached to it? Because if there wasn't, I could almost see me not doing it. What the fuck are you supposed to do? If there was an achievement, then yes, I did it. Because I platinum the... I platinum the game. Or the single player, anyway. Seriously, what are you supposed to do? How are you supposed to do this? How did Decino do this? Without saving the entire level? How? How do you deal with all this? Like, this is ridiculous! How are you supposed to do this?!
Trying to save ammo. Bad idea. Bad idea. Okay, I'm alive. I am dead. I'm alive. I, I am alive. I am dead. <laughs> well, like, I don't know if you've ever watched uh, the YouTuber uh, Decino J. So, Decino is like a, an expert level Doom player. And, uh, his whole shtick is that he does mods, uh, with, uh, nothing but pistol starts, 100% secrets, 100% kills, uh, no saves. Just no saves. So, every time you see him do a level, he one-shots it without, without saving. Yes, I actually noticed I'm at 13 subs. I don't know where the heck they came from all of a sudden. I must because I, I my Doom Eternal streams have done much better on YouTube than they have on Twitch for some odd reason. Um, God, there's two enemies left. What garbage awaits me now? Um, so maybe two people stumbled upon my. Uh, my YouTube channel through that and subbed. Okay, no, 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 wait, actually, hang on here. Yep, still at 25 Twitch followers. What just happened? Oh, there's two of you. So it's 50 Twitch followers, not 50 followers across platforms. Yes, 50 Twitch followers so that and that's just to get monetized Jesus and that's just to get monetized on twitch right so the way it works is that uh, I've been doing twitch followers because streamlabs tracks that really easily where am I going Because I know I don't want that exit. There's a different exit that I want. To uh, throw all these switches type deal. You try telling Deceano to play Doom Zero and Doom 3. I don't know if Doom 3 is up his alley. Doom. Th Although, I almost feel like. Didn't he play Doom 3? I feel like he did. I don't know. <laughs> uh, but yeah, as I was saying, um, you need 50, follow uh, 50 followers on Twitch to get monetized on Twitch. Um, and that's what I was kind of going for. I have my uh, YouTube Squid Gang, who are awesome. <laughs> but... Uh, but at the same time, I've also said I don't know if I'm even, I would even sign the uh, Twitch affiliate contract because it's garbage.
Okay, I feel like I'm missing switches. I must be. Because I was kind of hoping my YouTube would grow just as much. Because, uh, YouTube... Because the, pro the problem with the... The, uh, Twitch affiliate program is that... If I sign that contract at 50 followers... Uh, I actually don't get... To stream on YouTube anymore. Twitch demands... Uh... A monogamous relationship. <laughs> Uh, when streaming so for 50 followers which isn't much and I doubt I'd be making that much off ads on Twitch at all to warrant uh, to warrant me only streaming on only streaming on Twitch I, I feel like I wouldn't even sign the affiliate contract I was kind of hoping YouTube would grow just as much because um, YouTube isn't exclusive you don't know if Doom 3 sucks, it's just not Doom. And I think that's the problem. I mean, like, if you took the Doom logo off of it and, like, slapped any old thing on, like, Mars Shooter or something stupid, I feel like people would have reacted much better to it. It's by calling it a Doom game when it, it doesn't play like people except, ex expect Doom to play like. Oh, YouTube's something stupid. YouTube's like, I need a thousand subs. But YouTube theoretically has more uh, discoverability. So because it has more discoverability, reaching a thousand is theoretically supposed to be easier. Just like I, get a, I have to get like a hundred... Uh, Facebook likes before Facebook will monetize it, but that also has a bit more discoverability than... What am I missing? I hope it wasn't some stupid like I need to put in the right order or something. Calling it a Doom game was a definitely a business decision? Oh, absolutely. It was absolutely a business decision. Because it's not... Doom. Really. Just one second. Now, let me look this up real quick. Because I think I've already saved, so I'm just going to have to clip through if that's the case. Should have a playlist. Uh, I think there's supposed to be a switch down here somewhere. Or up here. Yeah, I think there's four switches and I've only hit three. Where are they hiding this last switch with such conviction? 
that I cannot for the life of me find it. Okay. There we go. I didn't find the secret, but that's fine. Birds of a feather. Oh, hang on. Alright, what's going on here? We got some floaty boys. I don't know what counts as a wall with this thing. <laughs> Do a pacifist run, boys. Ah, <laughs> uh, pacifist, you all hurt each other. Actually, I saw an arch file. He's in one of the cages that the uh, chain gunners were in. He's up there. Or at least I'm pretty sure that's where I saw one. Well, I am not ready to deal with Huey yet at all. How can the Macius never shoots at you when you need it to? I mean, now he's shooting, which is nice, but... Ah, oh, there he is. Oh, there they are! Okay, I'm really confused as to what the strat of this level is. <laughs> yes, the man just hits me in the face. Of course he hits me in the face. Isn't that my life? Okay. You got me fucking shit me. I'm <laughs> stupid. I'm <laughs> Guys, I think I'm bad at Doom. Like, I knew I wasn't great, but I didn't know I was bad at the game, and yet, here we are. Like, how does that even happen? Okay, I just need I just need all of you to die now. Okay, thank you. Well, yes, look at all the ge geometric shapes and everything. The level's messing me up. I don't know where to look. I don't know what I'm doing. That's the strat. You wanna you wanna punch a revenant to death. Like so. See that? Perfect. Dead. Oh, and then this opens up as I hit those switches. I see. Ah. I have a hair in my eye. Ugh, my god. It hurts.
Oh, right. Okay. Back to what we're doing. Okay, got me some armor. Let's try it again. Oh, you can bring the chain gunner back to life. I don't care about that. Bring him back to life all you want. Alright. We're 8 percent it. And I don't feel bad about save spamming at all. I mean, I'm, again, I'm a mediocre Doom player. I, it's, I think it's badass enough that I'm even attempting to do some must. I think I deserve respect for even trying. <laughs> I think I deserve respect for even trying. And there's no way I'm going to be able to do this shit with pistol runs. Without saving. Which is, I'm assuming, the correct way. I'd be here for years. Mm, yeah, so like, is there a med kit? Or something? No, I'm just dead? Okay. Probably shouldn't have saved with 4% or 8% health. <laughs> that was probably a mistake. Oh yeah, the arm bonus. That was really worth it. See, I already know this level's gonna throw me like a really weird curveball. Because there's only 57 enemies. And the last couple I've done have had like. 200 and something. Okay, I, I don't think I can hit him. From here. Yeah, see, here's the arch file. <laughs> it's like, come on, I can do it. See, these are levels you don't like more Doom 2 design than Doom. So, so, what exactly is your gripe with, you say, levels like this? What, what, what is your gripe? Is it they're too wide open, or, or what? You like, like, tight contained levels? Well, what's your jam? I fell. Ooh, can I pick that up? Oh, shit. I should go get that first. Too wide open, you don't like when enemies can hit you and you can't hit them. Well, yes, I can certainly agree that if enemies can hit you and you can't hit them, that is extremely irritating. It's...
Oh, it just sets me back up here. Because there's nothing you can do about it, right? And that and that's what's really annoying about that kind of thing is no matter what you do, if you're at that kind of distance and they're just fucking you up, there's nothing you can do about it. And and the worst part is I don't know if that's intentional design for them to be able to hit you and you not being able to hit them. Because if it's intentional design, my question my first question would be why? <laughs> Why would you do that intentionally? And Plutonia is your jam, huh? See if I can do it. Can I punch the Hell Knight to death? Nope. <laughs> now that was the, the arch file doing that, I can't. So can I line of sight the arch file a little bit? Well, I got it that time. Pain chance! Pain chance! Turns out you shouldn't try to pain chance an arch file. It turns out that's actually a very stupid move that you should never, never try. I, I just can't do that, apparently. Well, I guess I'm just doing this now. I'll have to deal with the damage I took and suck it up like a man. Okay, so what am I supposed to do here? If anything. Because it looked like I needed keys for both of those switches. Those chain gunners are shooting at me. I don't know if they can hit me or not, but... Let's assume they can. Let's see. So, okay, yeah. Uh, switch and switch. Both of those need keys. So there's keys right there. Well, the water doesn't hurt me. That was polite of it. What about down here? I don't know why he's got armor bonuses lying around like they're going to help me. Well, none of this does anything. Alright. Wait, was there something there? No? Okay. Hmm. If I go up here, is there anything I can do? It doesn't look like it. It's like it looks like it's Oh. So that's not really a switch. <laughs> that's a line switch. Um. Okay, so this was a secret. I mean, I don't, I don't have a problem with this being the secret, but I still don't know where I'm supposed to go. I guess I'm happy I found the secret. Oh, I literally just can walk up here. I thought that... For some reason I didn't think I'd just be able to walk up on that, because it looks like there's a railing in the way. Well, don't I feel foolish.
Uh, let's see what do throwing these does. Something good. Nothing good has occurred. Hmm. And what does this do? I don't know what that did. I am confused. What is this? Does this do anything? How do, how do I how do I anything in this level? Um. Okay, so I'm just supposed to jump for it. That can't be right. You thought I liked Arch Files? I, I... Okay. I mean, as an enemy, they're certainly very different from everything else that the game has. And variety's good. But this wad, and many wads like it, like Plutonia, sure do love their arch files, don't they? Like, am I doing this wrong? Cause that certainly I got how did I get there the first time? Do I just need more momentum? How did I do it the first time? It's because I'm hitting the torch? How did I do it the first time? <laughs> that seriously can't be what I'm meant to do though, is it? Do they really want me to like diagonal run at that? That that can't be right, can it? Although, who knows with this wad. Uh, but now I'm like bothered, like how did I do it the first time? I did it for the fir I did it on my first try the first time and now I can't recreate it whatsoever. Well, one key switch seems to release an arch file. I'm guessing both key switches brought these down. Because those weren't there before. And one, of course, released the Arch Vial, which is hilarious. Because, of course, it released an Arch Vial. Why wouldn't it release an Arch Vial? Every switch in this goddamn wad releases an Arch Vial. There's nothing else over here, though. I don't understand. What am I missing? Gotta love secret levels that kind of jerk you around a little bit, eh? Ah! Yeah, I see, not even close. Well, that box of bullets could, in fact, be on a, t a testosterone. That is possible. Um, I, I will check to see if it's on a testosterone. It is not. Neither is this one. Neither of these are on a testosterone. You know, I swear, Jay, I think all we're just going to do from now on is just uh, call everything by your autocorrect, just like we've been calling it the un-American, you know, ever since you made that mistake, and now there's no teleporters in this game. There are only testosterones.
Okay. So I did it that time. And again, like, I did it in such a way it felt like I had room to spare. Okay, that started to work. Hang on. It is the lore of this channel. Okay, I don't have a lot of health. So I'm wondering if fucking with this chain gunner is the way I want to go about doing this. Right into my face. I do have a BFG, but it uh, didn't, this doesn't feel like the right place to use it. <sighs> oh no, there's demons testosteroning in! <laughs> oh no! Let's hope I didn't need that BFG for anything. <laughs> Better use the un-American. This game doesn't have an un-American, unfortunately. That sucked. Let's do that again. What the hell is this? Pain chance? No. Of course there wasn't a pain chance. Oh, what the fuck? <laughs> Okay, hang on. I'm going I'm going to an exploit a doom glitch. I'm not gonna take explosive damage if I stand right here. I'm just gonna take the initial twenty damage and not take any of the explosive damage. <laughs> Thank you, Decino, for enlightening me as to the glitchiness that is the uh, Doom 2 engine. Give me, give me, fine. Was that really all chain gunner doing that damage? Okay, so there is a soul sphere up there. The testosterone was strong. Yeah, there is so much testosterone in this level. The amount of testosterone is just ridiculous. I don't know how you're made to handle so much testosterone in. All right. How do I get in here? Okay, up here. All right, what did that do? Oh. 
Okay, actually, I, I, actually, now that I think about it, I assume I know what the, what it did. I'm assuming it opened up. Ah, yes, right here. I didn't know the demon engine would just let you teleport in torches like that. Sorry, demon. That's it? It says it's all the enemies. Um, hello? Hello? <laughs> I'm confused. What's going on? Okay. Have I not collected... Um... Maybe it's a collection thing. I don't think I can walk across the railing. I think I'm missing something here. Okay, well I didn't take that at, uh, correctly at all. <sighs> hey guys, get to watch me do this for... An hour and a half here. <laughs> As I desperately try to replicate this jump. There we go. Okay. So I came up here. And I came over. I gotta come over here. Grab that. What is that supposed to be? Alright. Does that do anything? Because this wad loves using, like, potions as trigger points. Potions or, uh, armor bonuses? Yeah, okay, there we go. Post coitus doom. I don't know how I feel about that. <laughs> Two minutes into doom and chill, and she gives you this look. No oh boy. Great. No way to start this level off without waking up a cyber deer. Oh my! Uh, uh, how you guys doing? This is now just chatting stream. It's not safe out there. <laughs> yeah, yeah. How, how's everyone doing today? Hi, guys. Hi, how how y'all doing? <laughs> you sure you sure the uh the the cyber demon kills all of that? I mean, maybe. Who knows? Who knows? I'm just I'm just gonna stay here in my hot tub and just you know splash around. You know. Woo. 
How many gift subs to lose the shirt? <laughs> Can't give me subs yet. Don't have 50 followers. <laughs> I mean, and even then, would it be gift subs? I, I had to have a counter up in the top left or something, counting down the... Uh... <laughs> How many until I get the shirt off? Because I actually think Twitch is okay with men taking their shirts off now. Can't guarantee, though. I would do it for the memes, but, um... It's a bit of a double standard, yeah. Maybe it doesn't count if people would be turned on by the body, which they wouldn't be turned on by mine, so it's fine. Alright. Okay, so, um... We're just... I'm just gonna go out here. Oh my god, how? Okay, well I'm guessing I just book it for here. Which way am I going? This way? Um. Oh, dear lord. Oh my god, I'm dead. <laughs> stealth level? More like a bound level. There's no stealth. They all know I'm here. There is, in fact, no way to stealth. All right, where am I going next? <laughs> yeah, where's all my chest high walls, boys? Um. Oh shit, I missed. Where am I? What is my location? Well, I got some armor bonuses. That'll really, really help if I get hit by the arch vial and get turned into popcorn. Oh, there! Oh my God! <laughs> how? How do? How, how do this? Okay. Oh shit, I forgot where I was. Yeah, this level is a uh, level is definitely uh, putting it a bit lightly, I think. Am I supposed to eventually be able to get 100% kills on this level? Is this a possibility? Because uh, I'm missing various important things to do that with, like... How can I not... How can I keep not making that jump? Like, I, I'm missing something vital, like ammo in order to, to do such a thing. I feel like... I should be making that jump. Okay. There we go. Um, okay then. They gave me ammo. I tried talking it out. I, I, I mean, I haven't. That is certainly something I could probably try. I don't. Uh, well, I, I hope I'm supposed to die because that means I did it correctly. 
Let's try, um... Let's try getting that key over here. That, that sounds like a strat. That sounded like a strat. <laughs> nope. <laughs> Stop it. It is a great strat. He just needs... Oh, shit. <laughs> he just needs to politely not shoot at me for a period of a few seconds. And see, he's just... He's not obeying that. Doesn't work. He just shoots whenever he feels like it. Let me out. Okay, it, it's legitimately just faster to load. I got it! I hear him dying! Couldn't even go check out his death. Oh, he did. He real did. Is there anything up here for me? Can I can I get things here? Nothing. Okay, so I have a yellow key. That is a thing that I have. Okay, so I've got one out of 105 deaths, or, or kills here. Let's see what this does. Okay, I guess we're just running for it. Ah! I have a gun! Oh god, where am I? What is happening? Oh my god. Guys, I think I died. I almost did it. You know, a really cool level would be a level like this with no ammo, but as you progress, crushers are triggered to kill the enemies. Yeah, I mean, that is a good concept. Like, uh, a Doom level where you don't actually kill anything, you're just... I need that health. Yeah, it's kind of dumb. Because I don't... I don't know what the strat there is. Because I did a pretty good job there, I thought. Shit, I didn't even pick that up yet. Like, Jesus Christ. I, I live. I, I did it. I are alive. Okay, so it closed the arch vile thing now. And I suppose that's fine because. Yeah, I'm assuming that's 
fine because up there, that's where the cyber demon is, I guess, supposed to kill them. Okay, this is actually fucking dumb. I mean, a little bit where they, instead of having it, oh, like I thought it was going to be, like you said, where I meant to progress without killing anything at first. Oh, you can just come in here. Can't see shit, Captain. Can't see shit. Man, oh man, what is the... Okay, so actually, the strat might not actually be... Try and get them to him them to kill the arch files. Whoops. That actually might not be the strat. I think the strat is to kill the cyber demons, then activate that switch. But not dying. That that's that's the key to this strat is to just not die first. Why? How are you not like? Hey, <laughs> hey, normal person, you are correct. I just died. Uh, loser Corner can attest that there have been many deaths since starting this mod. Which I have been doing on a pistol start basis because I guess I just revel in self-hatred. Just... Oh, my god almighty. Tried the head-on approach. Oh, oh, it did work actually. Didn't work that time. Ugh. How you doing, normal person? Anyway, how, how, how you doing today? Probably doing better than me. That's a lot of dodge you just made. No kidding. Uh, Loser Corner, actually, when I started this mod, was actually trying to keep track of how many times I died. He gave up at 247. Like, my estimate is that I'm well into the 300s by now. Alright. Okay. Oh, okay. supposed to do 
Yeah, 247. And that's 247 until he gave up. He stopped counting. Because he was keeping track of, like, a piece of, like, cardboard or something that he had, and then he just gave up. <laughs> so, it looks like I have to do this. Where even am I? <laughs> So there's no other way out. Excuse me, pardon me, excuse me, out the way. Okay. This didn't open up anything else? How am I supposed to... Seriously, how am I supposed to... I am legitimately confused. as to what I'm supposed to do. Every time I think I got it, you feel like you can make levels based on this? What would your level look like? Just the most amount of arch files. <laughs> like, it doesn't open up any other fucking doorways. Like, they're saying I have to go out through there. But how are you supposed to do that? Like, you can't even avoid this shit, right? I'm glad Loser Corner gave up because this number now would just be stupid. I legitimately don't understand. I mean, I'm out! <laughs> Maybe the strat was to keep this... Like, maybe the strat was to keep the cyber demons up, but even that... But even that seems like it would be inconsistent, because I'd really just have to hope that the cyber demons play nice. Oh my god. How are you supposed to do this? Well, I mean, I guess it technically does, but it's not doing enough damage. That's the problem is, once one starts doing their attack, 
I'm fucked. Cause then I can't move anywhere. Uh, yeah, I made it. I got out. Like, what the fuck is this now? <laughs> how, how do? I'm so confused. If I even, because even if I left the cyber demons up, I feel like I'd still be fucking with this way too much. No, lose your corner. No, I am. I am the opposite of okay. I am. I am in physical pain. Well. Oh, <laughs> Ah, oh, I thought I got down that time. <laughs> like, I don't know even know where the proposed exit is. Like, where, what, what is the proposed exit here? Yeah. I accidentally dropped my overlay down. See, because that's the problem. I get stuck up in the top corner and I can't dodge it anymore. Like, guys, I'm in pain. I'm in physical fucking pain. My character's in pain, I'm in pain. I don't know what the solution is to this hellhole of a level. Well, they're blocking, like, every... Every facet of this spot. Why am I sliding? What is... See, look, let me, let me see if I can just show you here. So, like, that's the exit switch right there. 
right? So... So, like, I actually don't know what the strat is here, because there's nowhere to take cover. Maybe I was supposed to leave the Cyber Demons up, but even then, I don't know. Because that still seems like a very inconsistent way to have tried to kill them. Because I'd really have to hope that the Cyber Demons aimed in the right spot at exactly the same moment that I dropped this pillar down. And their chain fucking me up. And once one knocks me back, where are they all fucking my fucking shit? <laughs> I started actually going up the stairs that time. Yeah, I was at it! <laughs> I was at it! Oh shit, I'm down! I'm down! I'm down! Oh fuck! <laughs> oh, so close! Guys, I hurt. My soul is in pain. Loser Corner, why didn't you keep keeping track? This would have been glorious. Fuck it, you know what? Let's just grab that. <laughs> God shit and the son of a bitch fuck ah! <laughs> I am okay. Everything's fine. Everything is fine. Nobody worry about it. I don't have any issues. Um, I think I died. There was death. Um. <sighs> I can't believe I got down and then didn't clutch it. Just let myself get fucked. I killed a couple that time, though. A couple of them died. There was death. That was a bad strat. That was... That's not the way to do that.
Yes, this is the second secret level, yes. Yes, that is, in fact, the truth. That this is, in fact, the second secret level. They didn't take out the oven maker. <laughs> Was that not correct? Is there something called an oven maker I'm unaware of? I'm okay, guys. Really, everything's fine. It really does appear that you need to get really lucky on on the RNG. There's. I can't figure out another way I'm supposed to do this. Okay, that wasn't autocorrect. Alright, what did you mean to say other than the oven maker? See, they're not dying in one hit either. And the fact they're not dying in one hit is really killing me. Yeah, that that that's what's killing me right there. I don't know what the correct strat here is. Do I Oh you mean the the unmaker? It's not so much that they took it out, it just didn't exist. It's kind of hard to take something out if it uh, didn't exist. What you, what you actually mean is you wish the Unmaker had been in Doom 1 and Doom 2. Guys, I'm, I'm, I'm in physical pain. You watched the walkthrough? What did it say? It is pure RNG. That's fucking fantastic. God, how did I get down there last time? How did I not clutch? Why am I so dumb? Man. Okay, no, that's not the... I feel like I'm fighting the tide doing what I just did there. Oh, shit. <laughs> Where did I just end up? No, the unmakery was supposed to be in Doom 1, its animation was Demon Souls. I need to learn about this. So it's like shoot the BFG melee as it's lowering to get the ma and then get the Megasphere and get to the nook in the corner as you are in G. Well, I ended up somewhere. There was somewhere that I ended up.
Like, even if I could just get down. I'm not shooting it early enough. <sighs> I'm gonna do this. Guys, do you have faith in me? I did not end up going where I needed to go. And I moved too early. The way out is to the left. I saw it. That is where the exit nook is. But that's not even what I'm trying to do. I'm attempting desperately to just get down. Because then I could fucking BFG them a bit from down there. Your faith is at 10%? Well, you need to get that up to 100%. I didn't say I was going to do it in the next couple minutes, but I'm going to do it, motherfucker. Where'd I end up? Oh. There's a hole there. Okay, so this, this is actually dumb now. If it's pure RNG based, this is dumb. See, so you're saying get into the corner. What corner are we talking about here? We talking like over here? Past the megasphere. So you want me to grab the megasphere and go to the left? No, over here. Okay. Hmm. Probably helpful I didn't hit all the fucking pillars on the way over there. Jesus fucking... I don't see that working. This room is not shaped properly!
It's about that time of night. I have to stop. I hate that the exit's right there, but if it's just RNG, I'll probably do it off stream. But finish it! I can be here for another like 20 fucking minutes trying to do it! Ten minutes tops, dude. I've been at this for twenty minutes, all twenty-five minutes already. Just this one spot. Dude, I got into the corner. The corner's not doing shit for me. God, shit, I almost got down again. Like, you can't convince me, the guys who made this. I was doing better in that I was killing more of them. Sure. But there's no long-term solution. Because, yeah, okay, I'm in the corner now. Now what? I can't I can't shoot faster than they were coming in. All right, that's the problem. Like if I go into the corner <laughs> you have to get to lose course. Subscribe! Well, I got down. What do you mean I keep suffering? I'm like, I'm spamming buttons. What do you want from me? Too many of them. Like, I don't know what. <laughs> and I got stuck in the corner. That was a good one. I didn't even get like one eighth of the way through them all. That was a good one. These 
fucking pillars. I have I have to stop the stream. I ha I have to. I'm going I'm going to throw my mouse. <laughs> I'm, gonna, I'm gonna stop the stream. If if worst comes to worst, to prove to you guys, I might do it off stream, and to prove to you guys, I did it. I might just record it and upload raw footage to YouTube, no editing or anything, just being like, look guys, I did it. So you know I didn't do it with cheats. All right. So, I'll just... <laughs> Alright, you guys... You guys have a... You guys have a good night. I gotta go. Well, he's probably wondering what I'm losing my mind about down here, so... You guys, you guys have a fantastic night. You're not buying it unless you see it live. <laughs> Dude. Dude. I said I would upload raw footage. What do you think? I'm good enough of a hacker to fake that or something? Ugh. Alright. You guys have a fantastic night. <laughs> Prod doctor. How, like, how, what kind of editing skills do you think I have? You guys have a fantastic evening. I will see you next week. Well, I'll see you guys Wednesday. I'll probably play more Doom Eternal, even though I'm losing my fucking mind at that too. And uh, but I'll I'll, I'll, see, I'll try Doom next week, or if I want, maybe on Friday, I'll just try doing finishing this. I don't know. We'll see. I have no idea what I'm gonna do now because I don't want to do do my Monday stream and just be nothing but this for two hours. <sighs> All right, guys. You have a fantastic evening. I love you all. Thanks, Jay. Thanks, Loser Corner. Thanks, a normal person, for chatting. I much appreciate it. <laughs> Good night, guys.